morning everybody. Where are we? Where are the museum? We're at the motorbike museum. But we haven't actually come here for oh, a tree. We haven't actually come here for the motorbikes. We've come here to feed the donkeys and the alpacas. So I thought I'd bring you guys along with me for the journey. Look, they're so cute. There's some here. Apparently you can feed them. There they are. So we've bought like some carrots and some apples, my mum said, because it's quite close to her work. She said, go along and you can feed the donkeys. Donkeys. Oh, we're coordinated today. Oh. Ben hates it when we coordinate outfits. Don't like it, but we both look good in green. So what are you supposed to do? Do you know what I mean? Power couple right there. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Should I throw a carrot towards you? No, we can have a wander around because there's um they've got like ducks and chickens and stuff as well, like all around, and then there's a couple more over that way I think. Right, let's go feed some donkeys. <laughs> so cute. Literally got the motorbikes right behind us. There's the museum right there. There's loads of them, isn't there? Look at this guy. Get some carrots out. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. All over it now. They're so cute. Hi. You got any more? Yeah. yeah. They're so cute. Oh, Can we stop dropping it? everyone isn't it if you're a motorbike fan come here if you're an animal fan come here yeah, oh look they've got a little shed and a pond and everything <laughs> she's trying to take off with you. <laughs> so cute do you think she's flying oh look they've got their little water and everything mark for the goats a little play park for them. Look! Look at this guy in here. <laughs> He's having a good time. Can, oh. these ones. Can you? This is one, this one is so cute. I remember him from last time. Hello! They've got a seesaw for goats. Hello! Yeah, goats love seesaws, don't they? Hello, Hello. honey. Hi. Hi. Oh, he's so little. I'm as bigger than him. Cute. I'd quite like to see them on the seesaw. Chicken there as well. Look, there's chickens in this one. Over here. Oh, this is so lovely. The little tractor and everything. It's cold up there, isn't it? It's a bit chilly now the sun's gone in, yeah. It's very big back house. Wow. Oh, it's so lovely here. This is called, what's this place called? Sammy Miller Motorcycle Museum, if you are interested. Just sing the little donkey song to get them to come over. Little donkey. He knows already, look. Little rustling of the bag, he knows. Do the little thing out. You get some? Oh. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. Yes, you are. <laughs> He's never looked my fingers. He's never my fingers. <laughs> He's nibbling them because they taste like apple. Do you want to swap? Okay. 
I went to stroke him and he just wanted a nibble of my fingers. Oh, That's an apple. Go give the other guy some carrot. The little end, the one he's a bit shy. This one always tastes it though, so. Glad one. Brush their teeth, really. Oh, you? This one down here is a bit strange. just got back to the car um oh my gosh as you will have seen i did film us feeding them like we just had the best time did we not mm. oh my gosh so cute um there was supposed to be eight donkeys my mum said but we could only find four which is a bit sad but i mean it's okay because it meant the others got loads and loads of food so we literally just bought some apples and some carrots from home chopped them up and they loved them so much I can't believe we've never done that before. And I brought my camera with me. Oh, that looks so good. That's probably the best one so far. Probably the best one. I brought my camera with me because I thought I'm just kind of taking it with me places now just in case we get like a photo opportunity. So I bought this one and I took this. Oh my God. <laughs> this one was like the shy one and he was like getting left out from mm. all the food, wasn't he? So we had to make sure he got loads of food. So I took a little picture of him. He's cute. And I'm just getting a nice little collection together, aren't I, of my pictures? Yes. That's the best one we've taken because the light yeah, was the good. Yeah, quality. You want to have it on a good sunny day, I'm thinking. But not too oh, sunny. Can't. No. Too sunny and ruins you. Practice makes perfect. So, anyway, just thought I'd check in. I'm not entirely sure where we're off to next. Um, but it's still like, it's quarter to three. So we might do like something else for a little bit. Then we're going to go back and we're going to walk the dog later. Give her a nice good walk. My hair is a bird's nest today. How do you fancy this? It's difficult at times. <sighs> but sometimes you've got to say to yourself, Ben, just pick yourself up, move on with the day. Do you oh know what I mean? Oh my God, you're so rude. <laughs> That's when you're supposed to go, oh my love, you always look amazing. Yeah, but no one looks amazing all the time. And that's just the truth. I'm not going to lie to you. My boyfriend, everyone, ever the cynic. Yeah, but I don't lie, do I? <laughs> Twin in. Twin in. You hate it, don't you? Yeah, I don't know. Look like how good we both look in green, though. Do you ice cream? I love it. <laughs> We've come to a place in the New Forest um, that usually has, like, it's really it's poor lighting, isn't it? Um, it's really nice. It's usually quite busy, but they usually have an ice cream man here. So I suggest as we come here, we've got ice creams and we're just going to go on a little walk. Not a massive one because it is quite, it is quite chilly. It's a bit of lighting, isn't it? Um, we're just going to come for a little walk. I don't really have the best shoes on. These are like my good Adidas trainers. Oh. But we'll just do a little one. It doesn't have to be a muddy one, does it? Anyway, yeah, just thought I'd check in. Oh. We're actually fully blending in with nature today, aren't we? <laughs> we go so where's Ben can you see yeah. so yeah we're gonna enjoy our ice creams I'll check in with you guys later we should do a, <laughs> we should do a drive with me no. you're so good at singing who you no I don't <laughs> I want to show off here I need to share a little story with you guys we're finally on our way home me and Ben have had a little bit of an argument um, you know, I like to keep it real, so I'm not going to beat around the bush. We've had a bit of a fight, haven't we? Mm. <laughs> I'll explain what happened. So we went on our little walk. That was when I last saw you. We were on a little walk with our ice creams. Ben's lazy and couldn't bother to walk very far. No, it was pointless. I wasn't even 
nowhere. Ben wanted to turn around, so I was like, okay, we'll just cut up here. Like, usually if you're in the new forest, you can cut up loads of places and it'll take you to, like, where you need to go. We can still hear the cars and stuff, so we just walked up this bit, but there wasn't an actual path. So we were like, oh, no, we'll just keep walking through, like, no big deal. We're basically walking through, like, the bushes and all the leaves and trees and all that kind of stuff. Like, it wasn't a path as such. No, we were walking through bushes. That's what I've just said. Yeah, but you make out like it's slightly your path. No, it's not. I didn't. You're not going to walk there. Right, anyway, let's see. Can you feel the tension? Because we're both feeling a bit on edge. Anyway, oh, I, I kept joking with Ben saying, oh, there's a spider on you. If you know Ben at all, if anybody knows Ben, he has got the biggest fear of spiders I've ever known in really anyone. Like it's worse than my fear of spiders. And I don't like spiders, but I can get rid of them. Um, ben just can't. I'll burn the house down before I get rid of it exactly exhibit a anyway so i kept joking with him Nasty. that there was a spider on him and he was like getting a bit upset with me <laughs> and then so there wasn't a spider on him anyway and then we got in the car we got back got in the car um you know happy happy days and then ben suddenly shouts and he goes, there's a spider on you so then i was like what no there isn't like there's no spider he gets out the car and i was like oh, for god's sake so i got out the car and I'm thinking, he's just being dramatic, do you know what I mean? It's no big deal. He's adamant there's this spider. We look for it for about 10 minutes. We can't find it anywhere. I'm like shaking and getting him to ch check my hair and everything. And he was adamant. He was like, no, I haven't seen something. Like it was the size of my hand. It was huge. And I was like, no, not buying it. Anyway, we get in the car set off. We haven't even got out of the car park. <laughs> and I feel something on my leg. So angry. I feel something on my leg and I look down this huge I Massive. I shit you not. Excuse my French. The biggest spider crawling up my leg, this big black thing. So I screamed like a proper well, stop in the a proper scream. Room. We stop in the middle of the car park, all the doors are open, I flicked it somewhere in the car, so now we've lost it again, we don't know what to do. All these cars are like coming up behind us, like and we were like, sorry, sorry, like there's a spider in the car. <laughs> So we spent another five minutes trying to get the spider out of the car and we're like trying to find it. So then we eventually found it. It was in like the little glove, not the glove compartment, the little compartment down in the car. So I could see it and I was like, it's there, it's there. And then we were fighting some more about who was going to get rid of it. He was like, kill it. I was like, I can't kill it. I just want to get it out of the car. He was going, kill it. I ain't touching it. You've got to kill it. And I was like, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. You have to do it's it. Why to man up and kill it, didn't I? So Ben had to face his fears, basically. I found a tissue in my bag. He just squashed it with this tissue no, poor spider no sorry you don't get free journeys on people <laughs> and get into their car for no absolutely no reason and expect not to die no <laughs> oh my I god i want to get into some random car and then i'm go, so oh, sorry no. like i'm very cruelty free you know i don't i don't agree with all that however spiders are i've never been, i haven't been so scared in the longest time i was literally terrified so Ben squashed it. I had to just chuck this tissue away. Like there's nowhere to put it. And I'm not even joking. Every single part of my body is itching now. Like it feels like there is something on me. And I keep thinking it's spider. Ben keeps flinching and smacking himself when we're driving. <laughs> All their friends are coming now. I just, I just needed to share that with you guys. Um, well, I don't like nature. You know, I like to think of myself like, if I watch I'm a Celebrity, I'm a big fan, okay? And I always think, do you know what? I could handle that. Come on, it'd be fine. I like to think in that moment, I'd be brave enough and hungry enough to face my fears. Nope. It could never happen. We've found out today the solid truth. I will never be able to go on I'm a Celebrity. You know, wherever my life takes me, that is not going to be one of those paths. It's an unfortunate truth, but we've had to face it. So yes, I just want to share that with you guys. You know, we're all good now. We're fully in love, aren't we? My no, dear. we're not. Ben. I'm so annoyed with him. Honestly, it's going to take him some time. I think he's had a hard, he's had a hard day. So yeah, anyway, just thought I'd share that with you all. We're going to go home. Shout I'm definitely going to get changed. Yeah, burn everything we own. Anyway, I love you. Pardon? I'm not saying it again. I didn't hear you. I love you too. Thank you. We're all good guys, you know, we've got to keep it real. We've had a fight, let's move on. <laughs> um, we've just got back, we're all fine now. I'm feeling a lot less jittery the whole car ride home. We were just like, oh, trying to feel like we had spiders on us, which is pretty uncomfortable. 
but not to worry we've just got home as i say we are gonna get ready and go out again take the dog out to the beach i think do you want to say hi Hi. I thought you were filming, not you, I meant the dog. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, that's very kind of you. Shall we go out somewhere? Yeah, maybe to the beach? <laughs> I love you, I love you, are so cute. Here we are at the beach. What are you doing? I'm gonna go paddle. The water is so calm. We need to be careful we don't get wet. Changed into trousers after the spider incident. Nothing's getting up there. Can we go, can we go get this? Can we go get this? Go get in the water. <laughs> She's not a fan of the water. So nice here today. It's quite busy though, which Isla's not used to having loads of people around when she's on the beach. It's usually quite quiet, so we just need to keep an eye on her because she can get a little bit excited. Does that smell nice? Oh, careful. Isla doesn't like when there's people swimming in the water. She thinks there's something wrong. <laughs> there's people swimming just over there and there's someone over there as well and she keeps like running over. <laughs> staring at them. Isla! They're just swimming. It's okay. <laughs> oh, thank you. Nice and soggy, huh? They're just swimming, baby girl. They're okay. Don't worry. All right. <laughs> she does not like it. What can you see? Huh? Yes. What can you see? Give me the water. <laughs> oh so, yes, you're soggy. You're soggy. Oh, she's found a stick. That was a three. Good job. I'm terrible at skimming stones. Find me a good one. I'll give it a go. What have you got? You've got a stick. Stick's your favourite thing ever, right? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? That was a like a five. Good job. Oh, I lose all my stones. Why don't you? I love things. Good girl, I love. I know, she tries to drink it, I'm like, that'll make you thirstier. Oh, stones are painful, aren't they? Hi, love. Yeah, I think I will. I'm going to say hi to everyone. <laughs> today. We have come out for the day to Weymouth. How long did it take us to get here? Like an hour? And a bit. Yeah. It's a bit of a long drive just for two hours. Busy, there was a bit of traffic, but we've come out. It's like we're supposed to have some nice shops here and like a beachy bit. So we're gonna try and explore, get some food first because we're both a bit hungry. Hangry. Hangry. I don't know if it's gonna fit. Oh yeah. What we're we gonna do as well? 
Get your bag done up. I'm going to keep my bag done up because I have a habit. you walk around with it hanging over with your phone and purse? I do. I have a habit of accidentally leaving open every single place I go. So yeah, I will show you what we get up to, but just thought I'd update you all. That's yeah. so cool. Is it all made out of sand? Obviously. Sand world. Oh my gosh, we should go there. Sand world. But they've got Shrek. Those dolphins. That is so cool. Oh, and that's the thing from um, what's that film? Guardians. Is it Guardians of the Galaxy? It's got that in. <laughs> Look. I love the old sweet shops so so much. Look, they've got fudge. Ben's decided he's getting a chocolate gorilla. <laughs> Let me see it. No, let me see a gorilla. <laughs> I get that as well. It's been a Such a child today, honestly. I always get the chocolate nibbles. So I'm going to get some of those. They're right over there. They're so good. Can I get some of the chocolate nibbles and the toffee crumble as well, please? 100 grams of each. Yeah. Thank you. Cute. Hope fall in. Know what you're like. Know what you're like, though. I'm Actually, no. You should watch me because you ask my mum, she'll say it's where the name Liability Lynch comes from. Me and water, we don't mix. Fall in everywhere, don't I? Nightmare. <laughs> Hello. 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 Ben didn't enjoy it. We literally just went and we found like a coffee number one. I know there's like so many places we could have got food from from here, but we just literally went to somewhere quick and easy. And we've been around the cute little shop. So we just went to the sweet shop. It's cool, that. Where's the driver? <laughs> He's behind. Oh, yeah. It's a woman. Such a nice view, isn't it? Stinks here, though. Mm. Stanky. Nasty. It's nasty. I'd love to have a boat. Look at that. Oh, my gosh, guys. I'm having this in my house. When I get one, this is where all the gin's gonna go. All the nice cocktails. It's only 300 quid. Only 300 quid. I love that. I love that so much. This is such a cute shop. Look, that's nice. Look at that dog statue. That is so cute. Oh, what a vibe. This is nice. Put your keys in it. Love that. Such a quirky little shop. It's called, I mean, I don't even know what it's called. Bibby's Shop or something. Look, cute coasters. Yeah, I love, 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 love. Can I take that one down? A bit wonk, but that would do, wouldn't it? Yeah, it do, We've just got back to the car. It's about 10 to 4, so our parking literally runs out in one minute, doesn't it? Yeah. So that's pretty good timing. But yeah, we've had a lovely day in Weymouth. It's going to take us about an hour, maybe longer, depending on the traffic, actually, to get home to Bournemouth. We've had a lovely day. We picked up, I'm going to show you quickly what, I know we showed you the sweet shop. I'm going to show you what we got. Ben decided he wanted this. You're such a big kid, aren't you? It looks fantastic. Anyway, he picked up this chocolate gorilla. Don't fantastic. Um, I went for a classic like chocolate sweets in the jar kind of thing. I always, always, always get these. These are the nibbles. These are the chocolate nibbles and these are the toffee crumble nibbles. Um, I heard about these through my mum who heard about them through her nan her nan my nan like they've just always had them from the sweet shop so we picked up some of those because they're literally my faves and then we went to the fudge oh, shop yeah. it was called roly's fudge and i just picked up this little one this is honeycomb fudge oh my gosh fudge is one of my favorite things ever and they do a honeycomb one so i picked this up this is like three pounds and yeah we got an ice cream we went into the arcade we won well you won one of these little Tango <laughs> popping candy. I love Tango, can we share? I don't want it, I don't like them. 
so we've got that so yeah it's been a lovely little day isn't it lots of little shops to go into had a nice little wander around it's been go blooming lovely so yeah we're gonna head home i think i'm gonna finish up the vlog there because i feel like i could hang on but i don't think we're gonna be doing a lot later are we it's gonna be a lying in bed watching netflix kind of evening because we've just had a really long couple of days so thank you so much for watching if you made it to the end then i appreciate you so much make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any content in the future give us a little like give us a cheeky little comment if you feel like it and yeah my little youtube channel is growing isn't it my love it is i'm doing very well so yeah make sure you do that comment down below if you enjoyed the video i literally feel like i say the same thing every time i close off a video but thank you so much for watching take care stay safe and i will see you all Oh, in the next one. Bye.